Hello friends, today we are going to learn about cephalometric landmarks. First of all, let's know about types. Anatomic, it represents actual anatomic structure of the skull, example nasion, anterior nasal spine, pogonion, etc. Second one is constructed. These landmarks are constructed secondarily from anatomic structures. For example, gnathion, gonion, etc. There is another classification also, uh, soft tissue landmarks and hard tissue landmarks. We will be studying all these landmarks together. So guys, let's start with anterior nasal spine. Anterior nasal spine is the anterior tip of sharp bony process of maxilla. It is located somewhere here. See, this is the sharp bony process of maxilla. A, S, anterior nasal spine. Second is posterior nasal spine. Posterior nasal spine is represented as PNS and it is the posterior spine of palatine bone constituting the hard palate. It is located somewhere here. PNS. So guys, these two are anterior nasal spine and this is posterior nasal spine. Moving on to nasion. Nasion is represented as letter N, capital letter N. It is the most anterior point on frontonasal process in the mid sagittal plane and it is located here represented as capital letter N. Soft tissue nasion. It is represented at N dash. It is a soft tissue landmark and it is the point on soft tissue over nasion and is present here represented as N dash. Glabula. Glabula is also a soft tissue landmark. It is the most prominent point in the median sagittal plane between the supraorbital ridges. It is situated somewhere here and represented as G dash because it is a soft tissue landmark. Coming to cella, it is a ge geometric center of pituitary sophosa that is midpoint of cella tersica. This point is present here and represented as capital letter S. Orbital. Orbital is represented as capital letter O and small letter r it is the lowest point in the inferior rim of orbit and it is situated here in the lower rim of orbit and represented as capital letter o and small letter r orbital Next is Porion. Porion is represented as capital letter P and small letter O. It is the most superior point of outline of external auditory meatus. And it is present here. Superior point as we mentioned and represented as P O. Next is Basion. Basion is represented as capital letter B and small letter A. 
it is the most anterior point on the foramen magnum keep in mind it is the most anterior point and situated here represented as capital letter b and small letter a base on next is point a it is also known as subspinal it is the most concave point on anterior maxilla most concave point this is anterior maxilla and this is the most concave point and it is represented as a capital letter a. second is point b it is also known as supramental it is the most concave point on mandibular symphysis as the point a was most concave point on anterior maxilla point b is the most concave point on mandibular symphysis and is located somewhere here and represented as point b articular articular is represented as point capital letter a and small letter r it is the junction between inferior surface of cranial base and the posterior border of the ascending rami of the mandible and it is located somewhere here this is the junction this junction is called articulate and represented as capital letter a and small letter r articulate next is pterygo maxillary fissure represented as capital letter p small letter t m it is a point at base of fissure where anterior and posterior wall meets so this point is present here and is represented as p t and m ptm pogonion pogonion is represented as pog it is the anterior most point on the bony chin and is present here represented as p o g soft tissue pogonion soft tissue pogonion is soft tissue landmark and is represented as pog dash and it is soft tissue over pogonion and represent here p o g dash menton it is represented as capital letter m and small letter e it is the lowest point on the mandibular symphysis and is located here represented as m and e next is soft tissue menton it is a soft tissue structure and is represented as capital letter m small letter e dash it is the lowest point on soft tissue over mandible and is located somewhere here represented as capital letter m small letter e dash coming on to gonion gonion is represented as capital letter g and small letter o it is constructed by bisecting the angle formed by intersection of mandibular plane and ramus of mandible it is constructed landmark so it is present somewhere here and represented as g 
O. It is a bony structure, but it is a constructed one. Another is gnathion. It is represented as G and small letter N. It is point located perpendicular on mandibular symphysis midway between pogonion and menton. So it is present here, somewhere between pogonion and menton. As we can see, this is pog, pogonion and this is menton. So it is present in between pog and menton. So the location of dantheon is here and represented as G and small letter N. Thank you friends for watching my video. Friends, hit the like button and please subscribe my channel for latest video updates.